Hi, this is Amy with I Heart Faces, and today I'm going to do a quick lesson on smoothing out skin. And we've all got dark spots and wrinkles, and I've got an easy way for you to fix anybody in Photoshop. It's really simple. Take your background layer. We're going to duplicate that. I always drag it down to this little icon here. It's really easy to duplicate. So now I've got two layers. We always want to keep our background layer in case we mess up. So now what I want to do is go up to Filter, Blur, Gaussian Blur. We're going to blur the second layer we've got there. I think five pixels is good. Hit OK. But now we're going to need to select their faces. Let's go over here and grab the elliptical tool. And I like to just do a little quick oval. Uh, that's not very good. Let's try a better one. Quick oval around their faces. And if I want to do another selection here, I'm going to hit Shift and the little plus sign comes up. And I'm going to drag my oval over her face. Then I'm going to grab my lasso tool and hit the Shift button again. And just sort of draw around their skin. Draw around their chest, neck. And that will add to the selection. Same over here doesn't have to be perfect. Something like that. You can hit your option key and it will have the negative will happen. So it will deselect. Okay, so now we've got their face and skin selected there. So now I'm going to create a mask. Go up to the mask panel and click right here add a pixel mask creates that mask layer right there so now the rest of their the background like their hair and the the sky all of that the blur is gone it's just on their face which is what we want but it's still a little hard core there so let's tone this down the opacity to about 60 go back to our layer there with the mask and make sure you've got black selected in your foreground, which mine is, because we're going to draw over the mask with our brush tool. So we're going to draw the black over onto the areas that we don't want to be softened, like their eyes. So what this black does is just erasing the blur. Let's go over their eyes some of that that you want to keep blurry. Mouth, definitely. You don't want that to be softened. Let's go over here and do her mouth. Um, let's do nostrils. We want to make sure they've got nostrils and eyebrows. Let's let those show up. And she's got some bangs here that we're going to want to make sure are sharp. Let's go around. She's got a necklace. Pretty easy. So basically I'm just drawing the black on this mask. Let's see. Let's go around her face here and just get everything that we missed. So now it's softened some, but it's a little too much. So it was 60 opacity. Let's go down to about 35, 37. That looks pretty good. So there you go. It's a quick way to soften their skin tone. So here's the before. There's the after. Very simple.